Hi everybody, this is Dr. Tahir again at Family Pediatrics. Thank you so much for joining us today. We have cute little Holden and Katie and we have Phil with us today. And Holden came in today with ear pain and he has an ear infection. Uh, with the type of ear infection that he has, I'll need to give him some antibiotics and some pain medicine. But along with that, I want to teach you a special massage technique that will help drain the fluid inside his ear into his throat. There's a small tube that we have that connects the ear to the back of the throat. It's called the eustachian tube. And that tube can get clogged sometimes. Um, and that can also make the fluid build up in our ear. Okay, so the massage technique I'll show you is kind of a technique to help pump that tube a little bit to hopefully help that drain a little better. Along with using the antibiotics or any decongestants that may, he may be using, that massage technique may also help to decrease some of that fluid and pressure inside. Sounds good? Yeah. All right, so what you'll wanna do is, for doing the little massage technique, you wanna use a, some kind of an oil uh, for him. The easiest one to use is simple, plain, organic olive oil, uh, extra virgin olive oil, same exact oil that we eat and cook with, okay? So you know it's safe to use on his skin also. So I have some of that here, and I'm gonna bring that over and put a little bit on my finger, okay? All right, Holden, are you ready? Isn't this fun? Are you excited? Holden is super excited too. So what you'll do is use a little bit of oil, and here I'm just gonna put this on a little cotton ball, but at home you can use a little uh, bowl or disposable cup or something like that. I'm just gonna put this here so that I can motion my, um, my thumb with this, okay? I'm not gonna put my thumb on there or in there so it stays clean. All right, so what you'll wanna do is you'll wanna use your thumb for the massage, and you notice there's not too much oil on my finger. Mm -hmm. If you look at my finger close up, there's hardly much oil there, mm -hmm. okay? You don't need dripping oil. You just need a little oil so your, your finger slides on his skin and it doesn't create heat and mm -hmm. friction, and that's all you're doing. I'm gonna put a little more because my fingers are a little dry, I think, there. All right, so what you'll wanna do is, hold it, honey, can you move your head just like that for me, sweetheart? Perfect. So it's this ear that we're looking at, mm -hmm. and what you wanna do is feel right behind his ear, and you'll feel a bone right back over here. Go ahead and feel that. Mm -hmm. And also feel his jaw right over here. That's his jaw bone, okay? okay. Now, he's got a couple of different kinds of ear infections going on. He's got the outer ear infection going on, which is more painful, mm -hmm. and the middle ear infection going on. Most kids have only one type, but uh, he has both. Okay. So we're gonna be very gentle with him so we don't cause him any discomfort. Okay. okay, sweetheart, go like this for me. What you'll be doing is you'll be using your thumb, mm -hmm. starting from up here, mm -hmm. on top of his ear and right behind his ear, and you're gonna gently Press down and pull your thumb down and kind of go around his lower jaw. That's his lower jaw. And that's the bone. So you're not going to press on the bone. That's not mm -hmm. going to do any good. But it's in between this bone and the lower jaw. Okay. So it's like a little groove that you'll put your thumb into mm -hmm. and gently move your thumb down like that. Just about, you don't have to go all the way further down. Okay. Just in that direction. Go and do this five, ten times, five or ten times, and then repeat that a few times a day. Just like that, okay? Mm -hmm. For him, we're being very gentle. Um, if kids have an outer ear infection like he does, it may be that it doesn't help with the outer ear infection. It's more for middle ear infection. Okay. It just so happens he's got both, but this is for middle ear infection. That's mm -hmm. what helps the draining, like that, all right? Does it feel okay, sweetheart? Okay, do you wanna try that? And just see if you can get, I wanna see, make sure you get to the right part of the, of the um, groove and that it's in between the bony areas, not on top of the bones. Mm -hmm. And um, so it's, op yeah, and it's perfect to be right behind him just like you're sitting. Okay. And that's, that's a perfect uh, position too. Good, so you stayed ahead of this bone and behind the lower jaw. Just like that, okay? Mm -hmm. And just gentle with him because he's got the outer yeah infection too, so it, it may be more tender for him, but he's doing well. So go ahead and try that about 10 times. Mm -hmm. Do that about three times a day. 
and that helps the drainage so you're doing something along with all the medications that we have to use. Sounds good? Excellent. Wonderful. Any questions you guys? No, I don't think so. Wonderful. You're very welcome. Hope he feels get, he hope he gets better for you very soon. And uh, if there's any problems, just give me a call. All right. All right so I hope you guys enjoyed that and uh, have a new technique to try for your children if they're suffering from an ear infection. And I'll talk to you guys later.